I've always been a fan of Philip K. Dick's writing. You know, the most popular stories everybody's aware of and as great as they are, we wanted to dig into the chest that's in the attic and say, what can we find that's here that no one else has heard of before? And so that is what created the desire to, to look deeper into his work and to find the stories that resonate. What is that? On vacation. You're not just gonna be somewhere else. You're gonna be someone else. Electric Dreams is an anthology series, meaning that every episode is unrelated to the previous episode. The intent is that even though they're all very different pieces, some taking place in different universes and alternate worlds and time periods, that they all share a commonality, that when you're watching them, you feel like they're part of the same generalized universe. The theme that runs throughout most of Dick's work is what does it mean to be human? How do we define ourselves, especially in a science fiction environment, in a future where technology has changed, and how have human beings changed? And I think it's really interesting taking these kind of, I think, very powerful, very real human stories and putting them in these exciting, larger-than-life worlds. It's an interesting way to get the audience into what feels like action-y sci-fi stuff, but it is actually very emotionally intense as well. Don't you think it's time you told me your real name? This is a real act of viewing experience because you genuinely don't know what's going to happen and you have to think, what would I do and how would I handle that situation? And, you know, hopefully it, it opens up a lot of questions. Once the episode is over, you want to discuss it. You want to talk more about it. What was your takeaway? What did, oh, I didn't get that. I thought it was this. Did you really? That's interesting. And, and we don't want necessarily to just lay out answers. Our goal is to ask questions. What is this place? Macon Heights. But Macon Heights is not supposed to be here. The great thing about the Twilight Zone, the main titles would come up, the music would come up. You could kind of buckle up and say, OK, take me on a journey. And with uh, Electric Dreams, hopefully people respond to the same thing. Sometimes it's scary. Sometimes it's just bizarre. You just don't know what ride you're going to be on. And trust us. We'll hold your hand and take you through this experience together. Five, four, three, two, one. We're artists, me and you. We're weaving dreams.